And welcome everybody, this is NASCAR 14, I am I Anthony, your driver for this career mode. So let's get it started, I was a two time back to back champion on NASCAR, the guy am inside line. So nah. we're looking to repeat, um, you can let's get started I guess, let's hit begin career. All right, here we go, guys. Got a new interface here. A lot of red going on. Oh, Fox Sports 1 logo added, I see. Uh, the Galaxy S4, which is a pretty sweet phone. We are at the Brickyard, ladies and gentlemen. This thing still flips by pressing X. I Welcome to the Enfield Garage, buddy. This is where we prepare the cars before each race. Okay, I'd like you to go out on the track and start getting used to how the car handles. All right, he wants us to go out of the track, guys. Let's see how we do. All right, I'm your spotter. I'm here to help you to reach victory lane. During the race, I'll be telling you where the other drivers are on the track, how your car's doing, and help you out with some of the pit strategy. All you have to do is concentrate on driving. Now let's get this test session underway. Good luck. All right, guys, so far I noticed uh, pressing R1 strolls you through the different, you know, interfaces. They got the steering wheel with and without a steering wheel. Uh, here's my favorite hood view. And, yeah, we're back to this view. So it goes different this year. It goes front to the inside to without steering wheel with steering wheel to the hood. Last year it would go the other way. Here we go. Very cool pulling out on the brickyard. Let's see if there's any uh, changes here. It says complete two la laps of the track. The track looks a lot brighter. All right, guys, uh, I gotta get concentrating, so enjoy. Here's a few things you'll need to keep your eye on, buddy. At the bottom of your screen, you'll notice a proximity detector. This will show you when another car is getting very close to you and will help you to avoid an collision. Just off to the right there, that's your speed indicator, your fuel gauge, and your damage indicator. If your fuel starts running low or your damage indicator is turning red, you'll probably want to come to pit. The tire indicator shows your current tire wear. If your tires get too worn, you should pit and replace them. Let off the gas as you head into the corners and go back onto the power as you reach the center of the corner. Remember, when you hit the accelerator too aggressively, the car can get loose. Don't be afraid to come off the gas and exchange power for control. The fastest line isn't always on the inside. Try experimenting with taking the high line on different corners. When you drive directly behind another car, you will pick up the car's draft. Your car will be faster when you're drafting which makes a huge difference at the super speedways. Although drafting allows your car to go faster, it also causes your engine temperature to rise. Stay in the draft too long and you'll blow your engine. Keep an eye on the engine temperature while you're drafting, and if it gets too hot, move out into cooler air. When the brake indicator shows, apply the brakes until it goes away. Nice and easy. Just keep doing what you've been doing. That's enough for now. Pull back on pit road and we'll go see what the owner thought.
All right, guys, very big day for me here. Uh, the owner wants to talk to us, so getting kind of scared. We did spank the wall off of two over there, so um, let's see what kind of damage we put on here. Ooh, we scuffed this right side up hardcore. Hopefully uh, he wasn't watching. I'd like to thank you guys for watching my videos too. Um, I know there are a lot of them and there's going to be a lot more now that this game is out. I'm going to concentrate on trying to put up setups more often for the community so everybody can race at every track without fear of losing that band I guess. But that's all up to you guys too, so if you guys have some awesome setups, um... The pit lane speed indicator shows you the maximum speed, speed you're allowed to drive while you're on pit road. If you go above that speed, you'll receive a black flag and be required to come and complete the drive through penalty within three laps. If there isn't enough time left to complete the penalty, then you'll have a penalty time added to the end of the race. So if you guys find out some good setups, message me and then I'll put them up. I'll test them and make sure they're fast. Alright, I'm getting real scared, guys. Here we, we're going to have to go meet the owner. Hopefully, Jeff Hammond takes it easy on me. Good work out there. I've been watching the way you drive, and I think this setup and these assists will suit your style. You're the one in the driving seat, buddy. You can change them to whatever you want. Our season is centered around the schedule. You can check out all the planned events and enter races from here. When you're ready, select schedule and we'll get started. To get a closer look at the car, you can press the triangle button to open the hood. As you can see, each event on the schedule is highlighted in different color. Just select an event to see more details about it in the panel on the right. The blue arrow shows the next event in the schedule. You can look back at the previous event and view your results, but you can't replay an event once you left.
You can set up the race length and the game difficulty at the start of each race weekend, but make sure that's what you want to do because once you start the race weekend, you can't change it. How do you feel, champ? Ready for the first race of the season? Now look, before you're ready to go out there and start qualifying, it's usually worthwhile to go out during practice session and get used to the track. Car up top, just looking. Stay down. Got one working the top. One outside. Watch your inside. Check your mirrors. Looks like he's going to draft with you. Looking high. Low side's clear. Don't worry, man. He's just trying to bump draft with you. Clear up top. High side's clear. Stay on the bottom. Far outside you. Still up high, clear high. Car right behind you. Car tucked in behind you. Car in line with you. Time is almost up, pal. Better make sure you're happy with your setup. High side. Watch your mirror. He's coming up fast. He's coming on the inside. Right side's clear.
Alright guys, we are going to begin qualifying here. Wish me luck. The car is really slow. Until we get some upgrades, I'm going to do my best. Look. Great practice, buddy. Let's make it count here. Chase that pole. Good solid lap there, buddy. Let's see what you can do here. Great laps, man. Top 10, just like we talked about. Big picture today. Top 10 grid position. Good, strong qualifying. All right, I'm very happy with my position right there with the kind of uh, equipment I'm driving. So I'm going to skip practice to... Um, Get to the Daytona Duel. So here we go, guys. Let's hope I can keep this thing in one piece. The Daytona Duels determine the starting order for the Daytona 500. You'll want to get a good position as you can on the grid, so give it all you've got. It's time to set the starting lineup for the Daytona 500 with a pair of 150-mile qualifying races, the Duel at Daytona. I'm Mike Joy with Darrell Waltrip. Mike, these races are fun because the driver has one responsibility. Don't wreck the car. Go out there, get some information, kind of prepare for the Daytona 500. So go out there, drive smart, and oh, by the way, try to win. This is the opportunity these teams have been working on all winter. It's time to go earn a spot in the Daytona 500 or load up and go home. On the bottom. Got a car low. Car inside ya. One inside. 
Low side. Still inside. Inside. Stay up top, you're good right there. Clear down low. Car on your rear. Car inside at your door. Three wide, three wide, you're in the middle. Clear up high. Inside. Work your way around him. Car inside. Inside. Keep rolling. You're doing it right there, man. Nice and smooth. Three wide. Three wide. You're in the middle. Right's all clear, bud. Car at your door. Down low. At your door. At your door on the bottom. Still inside. Put it on the high side. You're good high. One down low. Car down low. Car underneath. You're good there. Right's clear. One inside. Got one work in the bottom. Keep high, keep high. One up top. Keep rolling, keep rolling. Stay low. I think we've got a problem, buddy. Motor looks like it's down on power. Awesome drafting, buddy. Great control. Car outside. Still up high. That's it. Come around. Car at your door. Up top at your door. High side's clear. Car two back. Whoa, don't let her get away. Yellow, yellow. The road will be open this time. Okay, let's get this stuff figured out. Okay, we need to be fast here. In and out. Let's go. Now that's one of the fastest of the day. Awesome work, guys. Awesome work. Okay, it's time to push that pace now, buddy. Stay focused. We can do this. He'll start at the tail of the field. One down low. Got a car low. At your door on the bottom. Still inside. Gotta just be smooth. Tom, 10-4. We're on the inside. Car in front's heading to the pit. Car high. Car up top. Put it on the low side. 
Looks like he's wanting to draft with you. Looking really good right here. Put her on the high side. Are up high. There's your next victim right there. At your door up top. You're good low. That's some great drafting right there, man. Clear up high. Okay, there he is. You got him. On your bumper. Car tucked in behind you. Car at your door. Up top at your door. Come on, man. Keep that momentum. Keep that momentum. Keep it low. Keep it low. Set him up. That's it. Car outside. At your door. Car high. Ten to go. At your door. Up top. Watch your outside. Got one working the top. Still outside. Car up high. Stay low. Three wide, two high. High side. Outside. Still up high. Three wide, three wide, you're in the middle. For your right side. Car inside you. Halfway home, buddy. Stay there. Coming on the high side. Three wide. Three wide. You're in the middle. Just keep a good pace. You're doing good. Keep it right there, buddy. Okay, hunt him down. Come on, you got him. Three wide, three wide, you're in the middle. Eight to go. Car up top. Very impressive. Stay up top. Seven to go. pressure on him. He's right on you. Well, you're low. Car outside. Car outside. At your door. Keep it low. Keep it low. One up top. Slam it into him. It's only going to wreck you both. Clear well, right. He's coming on the outside. Outside. Six to go. Car outside you. One outside. Stay on the bottom. There you go. Cover your outside. Play your right side.
Car outside, at your door. Still up high. Stay down. Car up high. Outside. Looks like he's going to tuck in and draft behind you. Five to go. One up top. Got a big shove coming. Car outside you. Car outside. Right's clear. On your bumper. Right's all clear, bud. One outside. Come on, come on, let's get past him. Clear up top. Car approaching your rear. Four to go. Car in line with you. At your door up top. You're good low. Car outside. Outside. Three wide. Three wide. You're in the middle. Clear left side. Keep digging. Check your inside. Car outside. At your door. Yep. Caution's out. Roll out of the throttle, buddy. Clean up truck, are you clear? That road's open. inside. Go high. Go high. One on the bottom. Inside. Car underneath. Looking outside. Closing up top. Okay, man. Nice and smooth. Nice and smooth. Did he just do that to you? Alright man, this late caution is going to add a couple laps. It's not over just yet. Is it clear? The road's now open. Crew's on the wall. Okay, we're doing two more. Two more to the finish. Car at your door. Up top at your door. Still outside. Car up top. Come on, you just gotta be smooth and calm. 10-4. Car high. Car one back. Clear right. Good drafted, buddy, right there. Nice and smooth. High side. Let's keep a good pace. You're doing great. One outside. Car two back. Clear on the outside. Got a car behind. All clear. Final lap. Give me one more good one. Okay. Behind you.
Car right behind you. He's still on you. Still right behind you. Just one of those days, buddy. Don't worry. Keep your chin up. Oh, man. <clears throat> what a race, guys. Uh, it was a terrible race. Um, a lot of three wide going on. Maybe I pushed it too much when I should have just held on to my position. Um, damn it. Should have had that, uh, had the W. But, <clears throat> really, wow, that's pretty funny. You can't save the replay. Unless, wait, let's try to just leave it right there. Let's see if it works. I think I'm going to end this video here. This will be number one. Stay tuned for more, guys. We're going to do the whole season. Uh, I will try to perform better. <coughs> Damn it. Just some close racing there, guys. So I'm having fun with the game. Um, I'm only at 90%, and they were running really good. Like, If they're running at 100%, then maybe they would have blown me away. Um, I'm talking about, like, what level, uh, you know, simulation it's on. Uh, the racing feels pretty clean, uh, almost the same as last year's game. Maybe it's a little bit more, better. So let's get out of here, guys. Oh man, I can't believe we really, really messed that up, guys. Should have had at least a top 10. Instead, we got a wrecked car. We crashed into quite a lot of people. Um, but it happens. <laughs> We get all these trivia questions again. Um, like, do they? Do we get to use the points for anything, or is that just? Need to update your, your driver application? You can change your driver details here. Really? Right. I think we're gonna switch this to I Anthony because I seen on my windshield it said YouTube. All right, guys, stay tuned for race number two, part two. We're going to try to do it better. Maybe we could get two races in in one video. Uh, this was just an extra long beginning. So. All right, guys, keep it up, and we will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.